Okay, so this is the pile PDMIC58 and as suspected I looked inside inside the connector which I'll show you in just a second here um, it has an XLR which should be balanced you would normally think but again it's wired as unbalanced. Uh, also going to look at the cable that they give you with the um, microphone. There we go. Notice it's an XLR to quarter inch adapter that's an unbalanced or balanced to unbalanced to a typical balanced mic to duplicate that of a Shure SM58. Uh, this is wired funny so let's look at that real quick. Okay I've taken this apart and as you can see right there that is pin 3 rather uh, the middle pin and if you notice it's supposed to be it's supposed to be grounded okay that would make sense but if you notice there's a unless this is just manu mismanufactured uh, you see that's not grounded okay pin 3 and pin 1 should both be grounded yes the shield here is grounded to pin 1 as you can see it's also grounded to this stress relief. That's fine. But here it should be grounded. And this one, I don't know if it's a defect, but that should be grounded there. So I'm going to get the soldering iron, and I will ground that and to make this a typical uh, three-quarter inch female to quarter inch adapter from balanced to unbalanced. Okay, now you can see that better. See it? See how that's removed. So that's something you want to check on these cables. So check pin 3. Pin 3 and pin 1 should be both connected together again to make this whole cable with the uh, quarter inch uh, proper a proper um, adapter to go from balanced to unbalanced. Let's go look at the microphone and we'll take it apart and look at the uh, connection inside this. Aha! Uh -huh. So as noticed, again the uh, Pile microphones, as was with the Pile 57 knockoff, they've connected pin 1 and, get it focused, pin 1 and 3 right there. See that? Okay. This one, this red wire here, needs to come over to pin 3 here, and you break that connection right there. Okay? So, that will make this microphone a balanced mic. Okay, observing this, I've wired it the correct way, where pin 2 and pin 3 there are both the uh, elements of the microphone elements, the microphone wires going to the element, and pin 1, so I'll put it right there, pin one right there be connected to this tab right there that's that's wired correctly so this is now wired exactly like a sure SM 58 okay I slipped the um, XLR male connector back into the body of the microphone and I'm going to tighten it now and again that'll be the second hole here see how the screw is there okay that, that watch if I push it in too far It'll go down, so we don't want that. Right? We pull it back out. That's one of the caveats of these microphones. Put it back out. Let it get back in there. Come on now. Make me a liar. There we go. Now we're going to loosen it. Remember the way you'd normally loosen a screw. All right. Let me get the camera right. So I'm going to take my screwdriver here, and I'm going to turn it to the left, and that will pull the screw out. It's basically like you're unscrewing it. Then you'll notice, as you do this, it will tighten. All right. Take your trusty pliers, pull in and out, and you notice it's locked down. So now, this is now wired like a real SM58. Also, let's take a look here at this connector. Focus. And you'll notice I've fixed the 
wire connections. Pull that back out of the way. That's not a wire, that's just a string inside. But anyway, I fixed that. So one and three are grounded on this one, all right? So this, because this cable is going to be, uh, that's going to be the uh, adapter cable. Well, let's put it together and see what it looks like. Okay, so I've now tested this microphone. Let's test it real quick. My talk into the mic. Only have to get it behind the camera. One, one, two, three, three. Hello. Three, two, one, one, two, three. Yeah, you can't tell what it's uh, doing here on the video, but it does work. And uh, so the cable I'm using is a balanced cable into the amp. And it does work okay. So that is the small amplifier used for checking all microphones. And it is unbalanced input, yes. And this cable, too, is now put back together, as you can tell. And it does work, too. I tested it just before I did this video, and it works fine. So this is the cable, again, that comes with this microphone. Do that. This is the PD mic 58 pile. That uh, is the... Uh, Chinese knockoff of Sure SM58. Uh, I did not do a side-by-side -side comparison since I don't have a 58, but this was to show how to make the microphone a balanced connection. And again, to check the balanced to unbalanced cable that, that comes with the microphone to make sure that the connections are okay in this because these tend to have shoddy connections. And again, pin 1 and 3 are to be connected here, and pin 2 should be the um, center connector, should be the tip, or yeah, the tip of that. And then again, 1 and 3 should be the sleeve of this. So this completes the wiring of the Pile PD-MIC-58 to balanced connection.